Hi, I'm Michael McMurtry, food stylist for Ingalls Markets. Easter's almost here, and in honor of a certain rabbit, I'm making a delicious dish starring baby carrots. Ingalls has everything we need, and I'm excited to share this beautiful recipe with you. Let's get started. So here we have rinsed off our carrots, and we're going to put them into our sheet pan with a little bit of oil, and I'm gonna toss them around. I've preheated the oven to 400 degrees, uh, we want to roast those for a little bit in the oven. Best thing to do is, uh, if your carrots or vegetables are not touching, they'll roast better. So try to separate them a little bit. We'll put them in the oven right here. 400 degrees for 10 minutes, and then we're going to toss them around and do another 10 minutes. Now we're going to go on to this mixture that we've got. It's a combination of almonds, orange peel, and thyme. So you have a three quarters of a cup of almonds, a tablespoon of dried thyme, a quarter teaspoon of salt, and we pulse it in the food processor and you get like a texture like this. It's sort of just chopped up. We're gonna take and put a piece of saran wrap down. We're gonna sprinkle this mixture onto the board, like so, just not too much. And then we're gonna open up some crescent rolls. This is always fun to do. Open those up, like so. There we go. All right, and now we're gonna find the end, get it started. And we are gonna roll it out flat, right on top of this crumb mixture of almonds and orange and thyme, which smells incredibly delicious right now. Roll it out all the way flat. And then we're gonna put some more of that mixture right on top, just like this. The combination of orange and thyme is incredible. And we're gonna mix it with something, you'll see. All right, so now we're gonna take and roll it out a little bit flat because we want all the seams to close up because we're gonna make our own cuts they're going to be completely different than what it comes in the package like. All right, so we roll that out a little bit. All right, that's good. And now we're going to get a knife and we're going to cut our own triangles. First we'll do one right down the middle. Then we're going to cut one halfway here. And now we're going to cut it into thirds. So we go Right here. It doesn't have to be exact. And then we're going to cut triangles. So each one is going to get cut into two in a diagonal fashion. And I'm not going to do all these. I'll show you what we're going to do. I'm going to get the carrots out of the oven and I'm going to start rolling them. Okay, so we got the carrots. They've been roasted for 20 minutes. And again, after 10 minutes, switch them around a little bit so they get evenly cooked. And we're going to take one. They're a little hot. But you want to put it at the straight end, and you want to just roll. Keep going straight, right at this edge down here. And you're going to create this little, ah, like that. It's going to look like just a little bed for your carrot. We're going to move these over and I'm going to put them right back on the same pan. We'll keep doing that. Again, we're going to just roll. And you don't have to be exact with this. It's just, it's all going to be delicious. All right, so we're going to roll up the rest of these, put them in the oven. All right, so we've taken them out of the oven. They've been in there for 13 to 14 minutes at 375 degrees. They're warm and they're crisp and they're full of flavor. They have the orange, the thyme, the almonds, the salt, and with these crescent rolls. And your guests are gonna absolutely love them. They're a perfect appetizer for Easter. And I hope you like them. And that's it. I wanna thank you so much for joining me here at the Ingalls table. I look forward to sharing more beautiful and delicious dishes with you soon. See you next time at ingallstable.com.